Many spectrum routers combine the 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz bands into a single network name for simplicity. However, separating them can significantly improve compatibility, especially for older devices like smart home gadgets and printers that only support 2.4 GHz. Older IoT devices rely on the 2.4 GHz band for reliable connection. Creating a separate 2.4 GHz SSID isolates the band, preventing 5 GHz capable devices from overcrowding the faster band and ensuring compatibility for 2.4 GHz only devices. To start, you will need admin access to the router. Default credentials, username admin, password often on the router sticker or Spectrum account. Ensure your router model supports separation. Most Spectrum models do, but check via the app or firmware version. Here are the basic steps to get started. First, access the router interface at 192.168.1 or via the Spectrum app. Second, navigate to Wi-Fi settings and disable unified SSID if enabled. Third, create a rename 2.4 GHz SSID with a unique name and password. Fourth, save changes and reboot the router. This ensures 2.4 GHz only devices connect reliably without interference. First, connect to your Spectrum Wi-Fi network. Open a web browser and enter 192.168.0.1 into the address bar or use the Spectrum app on your phone. Log in using your router's credentials, which can usually be found on a sticker on the router itself or within your Spectrum account details. Once logged in, navigate to the wireless or Wi-Fi settings, often located under advanced settings or network settings. Look for an option like Smart Connect or Unified SSID and disable it if it's enabled. This feature combines both bands into one. Next, find the 2.4 GHz settings. Here, you can create or rename the SSID specifically for the 2.4 GHz band. Set a unique name for the 2.4 GHz network, for example, Spectrum 2.4G, and set a unique password to differentiate it from your 5 GHz network. Choose WPA3 or WPA2 encryption for enhanced security. Finally, save your changes and reboot your router. Your devices will now need to reconnect to the appropriate network so manually select the Spectrum 2.4G network on your 2.4 GHz compatible devices. If you don't see the option to separate the bands, make sure your router's firmware is up to date. If issues persist, contact Spectrum support.